Let's try this one again. Um, I did it once and the audio didn't show up. So anyhow, we have um, a 15 volt supply in this case. Hang on a sec. Things are going away. There we go. We have a 15 volt supply and a minus 2 volt supply. This is a two supply emitter bias circuit. Uh, sometimes in a circuit you will have a positive and negative voltage sources. Um, we have a 0 0.7 volt drop here across the base to emitter junction. That would mean that if RB was small enough, then the current here wouldn't uh, give it much of a voltage drop. So if we assume minus 0 0.7 volts here, um, this is kind of a quick and dirty method, minus 0 0.7 volts at the emitter, because this is at zero, zero volts, minus 0 0.7 volt drop, so this is minus 0.7 volts there. Voltage across RE is 2 volts minus 0.7 volts is equal to 1.3 volt drop from here to here. And that means we have 1.3 milliamps in RE. So up here in collector current, if collector current and emitter current are the same or are relatively close enough, um, we would have 1.3 milliamps here. Voltage across RC is 1.3 milliamps times 3.6 k ohms, which is 4.68 volts. Uh, voltage collector to emitter is VCC minus the VRC uh, minus a negative 0.7 volts. Yeah, that's this. And so we got 15 volts minus 4.68 volts plus 0.7 volts equals 11.2 volts VCE. They are assuming, of course, that this is approximately, let's see, VB is approximately 0 volts. Um, And we covered everything else.